Yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Look at this. Wow. Wow. Yeah, there we go. Wow. Good luck. Take a good look at those cliffs. So that's so, the scale of what they were climbing. So we mentioned um, grappling hooks, uh, projectile hooks off, off the boat. The percentage that actually gripped onto the top of the cliff was very low. It, it was very much what you see in G.I. Joe. It, 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 was, it, was very, it wasn't as successful as it could have been. The, the ropes were wet that the grappling hooks were attached to, so they were heavier. So their trajectory uh, workings out obviously didn't work. And you had handheld projectiles as well. So obviously we talked about the um, the rocket uh, sorry the rockets off the LCAs. They also had like little handheld rocket launchers as well to fire ladders and ropes up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just curious how you how you are using this now. Um, is this just a it's this a concept? What do you, what are your plans for? Yeah. So I. So I'll touch on it, and Joe will, will elaborate. This is very much a proof of concept, um, purely because we are wait. Obviously, we're waiting for this pandemic to to lift, and then we can start presenting to the to the right people. We've already had the right conversations with with people in in education and museums, etc. But as a proof of concept, Karen, we're very close yeah. to having something that we feel could be rolled out. I would love at one point for this yeah. to be like completely open source. Yeah. To take a snapshot in yeah. time, 12 midday on June the yeah. 6th, 1944 D-Day. Yeah. Yeah. Get everyone, get a map of the of the whole of uh, Normandy, yeah. and yeah. everyone is there building it. <laughs> um, <laughs> and that's what we can do in VR. So if it is yeah. a case of there needs to be some sort of um, gauge of whether you've absorbed the information, we can put that in VR. So even if it's basic questions or show me... Show me yeah. um, where the bunkers were situated, or why yeah. were the bunkers situated there? Well, they yeah. were situated there because it fired right. onto the beaches. Yeah. I, I'm so excited to, to see what education and, and even travel and tourism industries will look like with virtual Absolutely. reality. Amazing. Uh, amazing. I do think it's we need amazing. to get some, we need to put some sort of standards behind it because some of the footage you get in 360 is not that of good. Of course, so of course, but uh, I totally agree, but I think we need more people getting into it as well.